It's Monday, Thursday, the day of Christ's great commandment, where he said, you must love your neighbor as yourself. I write about this today on Positive Daily Inspiration. If you don't get this, you can go to our web page, which is positivechristianity.org, click on the archives. You'll be able to read today's message and 40 of the most recent messages. Holy Thursday is a remarkable time. It is a time where he taught the ultimate commandment. But it's also a time where he was teaching by example of overcoming the world. And it is an important thing for us that seek to follow Jesus Christ to do. All of us face adversity at times. On occasion, we must endure the disappointments and even sometimes the tragedies that come to us as frail human beings. Yet, when we read the words of the Bible, 1 John 5, verse 4, it says this, Whatever has been born of God conquers the world. This is the victory that has conquered the world and can again in your life. It reminds us to accept God's grace. We go from being victims to being victorious. God will enable us to overcome the temporary hardships of the world when we rely on God's strength. And isn't that the ultimate Easter experience for us? to have a resurrection above former difficulties, when we rely upon God's strength, God's love, and God's promise of eternal life, we have eternal life in our lives right now. It's not so much an after-death proposition as it is eternally living, fully alive, every moment of our life, and then, of course, beyond. When we face the inevitable difficulties of life, God always stands ready to deliver us. When we call upon God in heartfelt prayer, God will answer, and God will come in a most miraculous way. God will come and heal those areas of our life that need to be healed. And while we're waiting for God's plans to unfold and for God's healing touch to restore us, we can be comforted in the absolute knowledge that our Creator can and will surmount any obstacle. Through faith in God, we, like Jesus Christ, can be true overcomers.